Welcome to Webstar Press. OpenAI announced their new AI model called GPT-40. O stands for Omni, meaning all. It can work with audio, video, and text in real time. It's not GPT-5, not GPT-4, not GPT-4 Turbo. It's faster than GPT-4 and will be free for pro and free users. You can try it right now in OpenAI Playground and on ChatGPT. I have it in ChatGPT as a newest and most advanced model according to OpenAI. They have shared amazing demos that show how personal this experience can be. This individual started the conversation by saying hi. GPT-40, this new model, responded warmly and quickly recognized the OpenAI logo on the hoodie. As the individual panned the camera around the room, the AI precisely described the overall vibe of the space. It's pretty amazing and looks like a real-time conversation between two humans. GPT-40 responds to audio inputs in 232 to 320 milliseconds. It matches GPT-4 Turbo on English text and code. It's 50% cheaper in the API, so developers can use it to create apps. It has superior VN and audio understanding. They have demonstrated some of its capabilities in these demos. This individual is inquiring whether the king is currently in the residence using a mobile device to record a video directed at the residence. GPT-40 confirms the king's presence by identifying the flag flying on the property, a detail observed directly through the live video feed. This is an amazing observation and detection capability. In this video, two instances of GPT-40 are conversing with each other, one acting as a customer and the other as customer support. The interaction is remarkably fluid and human-like. Previous attempts to create such videos using ChatGPT-4 were less impressive as there were delays of 3 to 4 seconds between each response. In contrast, this GPT-40 conversation is instantaneous and seamless. This video showcases the real-time vision capabilities of GPT-40. The AI utilizes a camera to observe and understand its surroundings in real time. Here, a person is consulting the AI about his attire for an interview. Let's watch this. Hey, how's it going? Hey, Rocky. I'm doing great. How about you? I'm awesome. Listen, I got some huge news. Oh, do tell. I'm all ears. Well, in a few minutes, I'm going to be interviewing at OpenAI. Have you heard of them? OpenAI? Huh? Sounds vaguely familiar. <laughs> Kidding, of course. <laughs> That's incredible, Rocky. What kind of interview? Well, it's for a software engineering role, but I just need to know, do I look presentable, professional? Well, Rocky, <laughs> you definitely have the I've been coding all night look down, which could actually work in your favor. Maybe just run a hand through your hair or lean into the mad genius vibe. Well, Your enthusiasm is what's really going to shine through. I don't have a lot of time, so I'm just going to throw this on. What do you think? <laughs> oh, Rocky, that's quite a statement piece. I, I mean, you, you'll definitely stand out. Did you notice? It's almost like if there is another human on the other end. This demonstration features individuals playing rock, paper, scissors with GPT-40 observing and announcing the winner of each round. And in this video, GPT-40 assists a young individual in solving a math problem, demonstrating its capability to aid in educational contexts. Here, GPT-40 aids someone in learning a new language by identifying and describing objects in that language. This video shows two people who speak different languages communicating through GPT-40, which serves as a translator between them. Let's watch. GPT, I'm here with my coworker today. Um, we'd like you to act as our translator for us. So every time I say something in English, can you repeat it back in Spanish? And every time he says something in Spanish, can you repeat it back in English? Sure, I can do that. Let's get this translation train rolling. Um, hey, how's it been going? Have you been up to anything interesting recently? Um, hola, ¿cómo te ha ido? ¿Has hecho algo interesante últimamente? Hola, bien. Uh, sí, un poco ocupado aquí preparando un evento para la semana que viene. Hey, I've been good. Just a bit busy here preparing for an event next week. Looks perfect, right? So here they say the voice mode in earlier versions of GPT involved a three-model process. 
speech to text transcription gpt 3.5 or gpt 4 processing the text and text to speech conversion with average response time of 2.8 seconds for gpt 3.5 and 5.4 seconds for gpt 4 that setup resulted in information loss as gpt could not process and observe tone multiple speakers or background noises and it could not output laughter singing or express emotion gpt 4o introduces an integrated model capable of handling text vision and audio end to end which allows it to process all input and output types through a single neural network this development is a starting step into exploring the capabilities and limitations of combining these modalities in one model gpt 4o seems self-aware OpenAI added emotions and emotional intelligence into it. It can connect with you on a personal level, just like AI in the movie Her. At least in the demos. In desktop, I can show you it's faster than GPT-4. This is snake game code in Python using ChatGPT 4.0 and it's extremely fast. And if we use GPT 4, now I'm using GPT 4 model. You can see it's a bit slower than GPT 4.0. I have Android and I don't see how can I talk to GPT-40 and turn on video camera at the same time. This feature is yet to be rolled out and it will be for pro users only. Hello. Hey, how's it going? I'm fine, thank you. That's great to hear. Been working on any interesting projects lately? Yeah, do you remember what's my profession? You're a web developer, working on any cool web projects? Yeah, it's a dashboard in React.js. Nice. Dashboards in React can be really powerful. Are you integrating any specific libraries or tools into it? So delay between conversations seems almost the same as GPT-4 right now. System is under heavy load right now because many people are trying to access this new update. and the audio chat was unavailable multiple times before this conversation so gpt 40 will be available for chat gpt plus users and free users gpt plus users will have more conversations limit per hour and will have audio and video support further they have shown different capabilities of the model such as poster creation for the movie detective they provided two photos and GPT-40 generated poster for movie named Detective featuring these two individuals. After some improvements, poster looked impressive. Character design capability. Here a robot was generated performing different tasks. Brand placement capability. Provide an image such as logo and get it displayed on products. Meeting notes with multiple speakers. This is so useful. Provide an audio from a meeting and ask AI to generate notes from meeting and highlight its important points. It will do so. Lecture summarization. So it can summarize video with exact details and highlight key points. Provide the logo and get it redrawn using letters. Change colors and background colors. So improved image manipulation basically. Good use cases and this is improved version from ChatGPT 4 model. And here is model evaluation against other AI models.
so it's got improved tokenization system this new tokenizer has been tested on 20 different languages chosen for the diversity across language families to demonstrate its ability to compress text by reducing the number of tokens necessary to represent the same information for example in gujarati language the tokenizer reduces the sample text from 145 tokens down to just 33 achieving a compression of 4.4 times fewer tokens so this model will also save cost the model underwent a red teaming by over 70 external experts to identify and mitigate risks initial releases include text and image inputs with the text outputs with plans to expand to audio outputs featuring preset voices and existing safety protocols so text and image capabilities text and image capabilities are accessible in chat gpt right now including for free and plus users with significantly higher message limits an upcoming alpha version of voice mode will be available within chat gpt plus later in coming weeks, developers can access GPT-40 in the API, offering double the speed, half the cost, and five times the rate limits of GPT-4 Turbo. Future updates will introduce audio and video capabilities. So we don't have audio and video capabilities right now. Right now, it's just text and the image. So the demos containing voice that got us all excited are for the upcoming releases of this model. Demos are cool, too good to be true or real, but the release is not fully functional or operational and is under heavy load right now. So this is my take on GPT-40. Let me know your thoughts and comments. If you have any questions, let me know. Okay, I hope it helped. Like, share, subscribe, and I will see you in the next one.